Today I'm going to be unboxing for you the FLIR 1 thermal imaging camera for your smartphone. Let's get to it. Alright, jumping right into it. Let's take a look at the front. FLIR 1 thermal imaging camera. This is for the Android. They make it for iPhone as well. Nothing on the side. FLIR on the top. Flare for Android. Get the glare off of it. And then the back. See the heat. So there's a number of applications you could use this for. You know, pouring boiling water down the a clog drain and seeing where the boiling water stops and to find a locate a clog. Open up the box. Clear one. All right. And here's the device. So it's got two cameras. It's got a regular camera and then a thermal imaging camera. So they, the software stack or on your phone stacks the images to where it gives a better outline. You can make out things better than just a standard um, thermal camera alone. Come on. Got things on the bottom. We've got a hard case here. Opening up the box. And the strap. Looks like the strap attaches to the case right there. USB. And a couple rubber bumpers. Adhesive on one side. I'm assuming that's to uh, obviously put on, on this thing so when it butts up against your bottom of your phone it's snug and, and doesn't wobble. A couple of these guys. That one just extends and moves it out. This guy looks like it reverses. The flat end here is on the bottom. Put this guy on and the flat end is on the top. Awesome. Quick start and warranty. A QR code there to download the app. All the other languages, some of the other languages. Come on. There we go. Just about lost it. And a thank you note. Thank you specifically. Excellent. Let's uh, click the thing on and take some test footage. So I've got the Samsung Galaxy S7 here. Come on, it's me. Here we go. Flare one. Got the app downloaded already. Touch your flitter one and turn it on. There's the power button. 
Hopefully the thing's charged. Oh. Any second? All right, look at that. Oh man, my hand's hot. Let's see if I can. Oh, dude, that's awesome. So, I think in this app you can take a picture. Boom. Change colors. I think coldest, if I know, remember right, picks out just the coldest parts in the scene or in the in a view. Oop, mode. Photo, video, panorama, time lapse. Another color's hottest. There's my blinds out there. The sun's beaming down on them. Pretty cool. Software's a little bit on the slow side, but that's awesome. Yeah, let's get some video footage from this thing now. There's video mode. Not sure if it picks up sound or not, but put my hand on the mirror. Alright, so a cool feature is you can turn, push a little temperature button and it gives you a reading of the temperature. This is the outside of my fridge, it's 54 degrees. Go into my freezer. It's like, I don't know, anywhere from 1 to 2 degrees Fahrenheit. Negative 4 on old Mr. Jack. Another thing you can use it for is uh, checking any heat loss or anything through a door. This is my front door. You can tell there's a little bit of heat at the corner there, which means some of the heat from the outside is getting through right there. Let me get up a little closer here. All pretty good. Yeah, definitely some uh, some heat coming in right there. Right, I've got some hot water running. Let's switch it to cold now. Boom! <laughs> wow! Back to hot. That is freaking awesome. And cold. Alright, I'm under my bathroom sink here running hot water down the pipe. You can see it's glowing there. This could be useful if you were to have a clog somewhere in here. You know, the hot water would stop at that point and you'd be able to find where the hot mixed with the blue and where that would be where your thing is. Let me turn the uh, cold water on here and see what happens. Changing, but slowly. There she goes. You can tell the joints, thicker material is staying warmer longer. There's the hot water line right there. And cold water line nice and blue if you like this video make sure to subscribe because i've got a plethora of unboxing and reviews coming ahead anywhere from electrical tools to camera gear and everything else in between so thanks for watching and watch for the next video soon